President Ruth Messenger, whose uh, legislative responsibilities and prior commitment did not allow here and did not allow her to be here with us to honor Don Pedro Mir. Ruth Messenger, Messenger has sent with me a proclamation which proclaims today, September 30, 1993, as Don Pedro Mir Day. When I came tonight to this place, I thought that what, what I must do was to apologize for my English, because I learned it from books and uh, not for life. So, I can't express myself in English. Although, I love too much this language. Perhaps I love it from my relations, or better, my early relations with Walt Whitman. It was a, a must for me to, to know this language to understand his poetry. And that's all that I have to express a feeling so deeply that even in my own language I couldn't express nothing. I hope you will excuse me. The counter song. Section 9. For what has a great undeniable poet been but a crystal clear pool where a people discover their perfect likeness? What has he been but a deep garden where all men recognize themselves through language? And what but the chord of a boundless guitar where the fingers of the people play their simple, their own, their strong and true innumerable song? For that's why you, numerous Walt Whitman, who saw and ranted just the right word for singing your people, who in the middle of the night said, I, and the fisherman understood himself in his slicker, and the hunter heard himself in the midst of his gunshot, and the woodcutter recognized himself in his ax, and the farmer in his freshly sown field, and the gold panner in his yellow reflection on the water, and the maiden in her future town, growing and maturing under her skirt, and the prostitute in her fountain of gaiety, and the miner of darkness in his steps beneath his homeland, when the tall preacher bowing his head between two long hands said, I, and found himself united with the foundryman and the salesman, with the obscure traveler in a soft cloud of dust, with the dreamer and the climber, with the earthy mason resembling a stone slab, with the farmer and the weaver, with the sailor in white resembling a handkerchief. And all the people saw themselves when they heard the word, I. And all the people heard themselves in your song when they heard the word, I, Walt Whitman, a cosmos of Manhattan.
país en el mundo, colocado en el mismo trayecto del sol, oriundo de la noche.